Hey everyone, it's Alex with Lever Fighter Writer, and today we're going to be doing a Conversion AI Long Form Assistant Tutorial. So uh, if you've never used Conversion.ai before, I highly recommend it. You can sign up for a 10,000 credit free trial using my link, which you'll find down in the description below this video. And uh, what we're going to do today is look at their Long Form Assistant, otherwise called a Long Form Editor which you can use to generate uh, and write things like blog posts, uh, emails, stories, basically anything that's long form, you can write in there really easily with the help of Jarvis, their artificial intelligence writing assistant. So uh, I've just created a new project in my account here and you can either click on when you have no projects or when you have no documents, like I currently have no documents, you have this write something beautiful button. Once you have a document or a list of documents, that'll be gone and you would just click on new to start a new document. And then if you go into blank document, then you just get a blank document with access to what they call the power editor, which is kind of their library of templates and frameworks. Uh, we're gonna look at that in a separate video though. So I'm just gonna go to the long form assistant for this one. Now, this is where the magic starts to happen. Uh, so you need to describe the content that you want to create here. And you literally tell Jarvis what you want to write, um, what you want it to be about, any details that you want to be included, and the tone of voice that you want to be used. So I'm going to start off by saying, uh, I'm going to do a YouTube description, or a YouTube, uh, yeah, a YouTube description, actually. Um, for a video that I have planned. So I'm gonna say write a YouTube description about, I'm gonna paste the name of the video here, how to make money on ClickBank, include tips and tricks, best practices, what to avoid, best products to promote, and how to get started as a beginner. Use a friendly and encouraging tone of voice. All right, so I could write up to 600 characters there, but I'm just gonna leave that as it is. And then for the keywords, I'm gonna put in how to make money on ClickBank, make money ClickBank, and affiliate marketing. Actually, I should, I should include something about affiliate marketing up here. So I'm just going to add in briefly discuss. Oops, I misspelled that. Briefly discuss affiliate marketing strategies and which work best with ClickBank. All right, so now I'm just going to click continue. And here, I, if I had a title in mind, then I could put it in here. Um, so the title is gonna look something like this, of course, but I'm gonna generate ideas and see if it comes up with something that has the, that keyword in it, but sounds a little bit better. So now it's generated all these title ideas for me. And we have, this one looks pretty good. How do I create a clip? No, I don't want that. So I'm just gonna go with this one. So I just click use this one, how to make money on ClickBank, tips, tricks, best practices. And then for the intro paragraph, similar to, um, similar to the title, you can either type it yourself or you can just generate ideas and it'll write a few intro paragraphs for you and you can choose the one that you like the best. Making money on ClickBank has never been easy or effective has never been so easy or effective. Uh, if you ever wanted to make money online, I like this one the best so far, so I'm just gonna hit use, and then I'm gonna say open editor. So now, um, over here we have our title, our content description, and our keywords, and under output length, you can choose short, medium, or long, and that will define uh, the length of the content that it outputs each time that you hit compose or control J. So I'm just gonna read through this really quickly. Have you ever wanted to make money online? Have you, have you been looking for the right affiliate marketing strategy that will work best with ClickBank? So I'm just gonna change this to on ClickBank and then this to affiliate marketing. So I like that a little bit better. 
If so, then this post is perfect for you. In this post, we'll go over how to make money on ClickBank. Change that to video. In this short tutorial, we'll go over how to make money on ClickBank with affiliate marketing, over what not to do, tips and tricks, and how to help increase success rate and much more. So I'm just gonna hit enter to go to the next line, and then I'm going to click on compose. All right, so I like this. Um, there is no one size fits all affiliate marketing strategy that will work right every time. It's important to find that what works for you so you can make money with ClickBank. You don't want any of your competitors to know exactly. I just hit Command or Control J, so it's typing for me again what you're doing to make money on ClickBank. This video will teach you how to do it. All right, that doesn't entirely make sense. Then we have some tips and tricks, what not to do when promoting affiliate products with ClickBank, how often should I update my blogs. I change that to create content or publish content. So I'm just gonna get it started here. I'm gonna say getting started on ClickBank Oh geez, that's terrible. As a beginner is, and I'm gonna switch this to long output and I'm gonna hit compose. All right, so it's given me some good stuff here. And now that you've seen kind of the basics of how this works, I'm gonna show how we can refine the usage of Jarvis a little bit more to control a little bit more uh, what the output looks like. So let's see, I was happy with it um, up until here. That was where I had read up to. So I'm gonna add three asterisks there. And in the long form, assistant, what three asterisks does is it tells Jarvis to ignore the content above the asterisks. So when you have three asterisks in the document, um, as far as the AI is concerned, this part of the document doesn't exist anymore. This is now the top of the document and it's going to read, it's going to read the info over here and it's going to read everything below the asterisks and above the cursor. So if I were to put the cursor right here, it would basically be considering it as though it's starting a new document. If I put the recursor right here, then it's gonna only read this paragraph before it writes the next part. So I'm gonna prompt it to continue building on this. Most people feel intimidated when they first start out, but it's actually not that difficult to make money with ClickBank as a beginner. One of the main barriers you may face is believing you can do it. I'm gonna hit control J. All right. So that is one of the commands that you can use in the, uh, in the editor, uh, the three asterisks. And the other command that you can use right in the editor is um, two hashtags. So if I want, I'm gonna get rid of this. And if, if I want Jarvis to focus on explaining a particular part of, uh, if I want Jarvis to focus on explaining or elaborating on a particular part of the text, then all I need to do is put two asterisks at the beginning of that line. So here we have tips for making money on ClickBank and I want him to elaborate on these two tips. I'm just gonna get rid of this and put a period here and I'm gonna get this tip started for Jarvis. focus 
on what you can control. Control J. All right, so that wasn't the best prompt. Many beginners focus on setting goals outside their area of influence. But, control J, I actually really like where it went with that. Uh, but it's important to focus on what you can control, like your own actions and work ethic. For example, don't make it a goal to get somebody else to promote your product. Instead, focus on how you can build up the quality of your product so that people will want to share it without any incentive or reward. Learn about affiliate marketing strategies like creating free reports or videos about how to solve problems related to the topic of ClickBank products. Focus on what you can control. For instance, don't waste time trying to convince someone else in ClickBank's promotional team Okay, that's kind of a repeat, so I'm just going to delete that part. And then I'm going to add uh, two hashtags right here to tell it to focus on that line. And then here we already have a few tips and tricks listed. That's not really a tip and trick. Um, what not to do in promoting... Um, so tips and tricks. Right, here I'm just going to say make sure you watch the whole video to control J. All right, there it gave me some good tips and tricks. Do your research before you promote your product. Make sure that the products align with your message and audience. Build up a large email list. Those are all good tips. So now I'm up to 650 words, which is a really good length for a YouTube description. Um, and that is basically how you use the long form writing assistant on, um, on Conversion AI. Now I might, I might clean this up in here a little bit, but usually what I do is I just use uh, Jarvis to get the bones of something down, to get the content generated, to get it moving. And then I'll take this and I'll move it into uh, Grammarly to really quickly punch it up and uh, change it, correct any errors and make sure that it all flows well and makes sense. So uh, that is my Conversion AI long form assistant tutorial. Hope you found that helpful. Leave me uh, co a comment if there's anything specific that you'd like to see demonstrated. Um, the next video that I have planned for Conversion AI will be about how to create a blog post. So we're gonna be using both the power editor and the long form editor for that. Um, so make sure you subscribe if that's something you're interested in, or if there's anything else you'd like to learn about Conversion AI, uh, just let me know. And again, uh, I do have an affiliate link in the description, which you can use if you want to sign up for a 10,000 credit free trial. Uh, I really appreciate you using my link. It's a great way to support the channel, and I will catch you in the next video.